it's, uh, it's crucial because uh, we monitor them uh, during all the time, uh, we follow them, we offer them all the support uh, and uh, these seminars are the occasion to work with them directly, to see them uh, in presence, uh, to work on the field of play, uh, to get some feedback from them, to to make some uh, evaluation of their uh, fitness conditions or their health conditions, uh, uh, try to see if anything is needed uh, in order to provide the, 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 the best solution possible. The goal and the challenge over the next five months is keep everybody healthy, um, to keep them, the fitness shouldn't be an issue because we have a very clear plan, but the health, five months, anything can happen. So we're really focused on making sure that the referees are correctly taking care of themselves. Um, because unlike the players, in some cases, these girls have other jobs, they have other work that they do, and so they have to find this balance. And, uh, but with the goal, again, of being 100% ready. Uh, the other side is that we still have challenges uh, for women in football. It's a reality that while many countries really support the referees have been selected, I mean, they're representing their country on the world stage. And still we have countries who don't give the enough matches to these women referees, who don't uh, take them to the training courses with their elite referees. So we're still needing to get make sure that the countries are doing everything possible in concert with FIFA, together with us, that they really believe in these women referees and they give them the support they need at home. So with that, with them staying healthy, we're sure to have a successful World Cup. It's a, it's a privilege and an honour to be uh, selected for a World Cup, but it's something extra special to, to be able to do that on home soil. Um, I think that being able to share the thing that I love with my family and my friends, they'll be able to come and watch the matches, but also uh, to leave, I guess, a legacy in my country for, for women's football. I, I, I hope that it will grow and inspire young women to, to either play or to referee. That's my, my hope.